there, this is Jessica. I'm sorry I've been away for so long, but I've been incredibly busy. Not only at work, but as many of you may or may not know, I'm getting married this summer. So there's a lot of planning that comes along with that, as you can imagine. Now I am an event planner and coordinator, so I've done, I've produced events for many, many years, but planning a wedding is something completely different. But um, it's been a lot of fun. For my bridal bouquet, I'm going to be making my own brooch bouquet. Now, if you don't know what that is, I highly suggest you Google it because they are beautiful. Which is why they cost anywhere between $350 and $600, maybe even more depending on the work and how large it is and what they're using. So I want to do it myself. I thought it would be a fun project and a way to keep the cost down. And um, I love it. On my online search for brooches, I discovered this company called FabulousBrooch.com. They have a variety of brooches, ranging anywhere from $350 to $15. Um, I'm going for flower brooches, that's what I'm looking for, with pearl and crystal detail, and they have many brooches that fit that description. So I want to show you some of them right now. This is one right here. This is one of my favorites. It's beautiful, and look how large that is. Here's another. So as I mentioned, I'm making my bridal bouquet out of these, so if they're large, they're perfect. Because if you're getting small brooches, then it's gonna take a, it's gonna take many brooches to make your bouquet the right appropriate size. So these are perfect. And they don't all look like this. Some are fabric flower brooches, and they have a variety of different styles. They have some vintage, vintage looking ones, different colored metals. They have colored crystals, but I want everything to be white and silver on mine. And again, with some crystal and pearl details. So I want to show you some of the ones that I've already created. These were not made with fabulousbrooch.com. Uh, brooches. These I actually purchased. I purchased one from Michael's, uh, which is an arts and crafts store that many of you may have in your city or uh, city near you. And the other ones I bought in this big um, like outlet jewelry store in Manhattan. Um, so I purchased them and I added pearl details myself. And I added, I made these stems out of wires. So I will be doing a video tutorial of how to make your own bridal bouquet, brooch bridal bouquet, because they are so expensive and you can do it yourself. Um, it's more affordable that way and if you give yourself enough time, there's no reason why you can make it, make it yourself. This is the one that I bought from Michaels. It was a pendant, not a brooch, but there you go. And this is one that I added several pearls onto it. Faux pearls, obviously. So again, fabulousbrooch.com. They have a great variety for um, different price ranges. Again, from starting at anywhere from 2 to $3. They go all the way up to $15. Uh, I think the average price that I paid for my brooches were around $5 or so, $5 or $6. Um, they have great customer service. I actually talked to one of the representatives on the phone because I had a shipping problem, but it was um, not their fault. Um, but again, they will email you back. They will call you on your phone. So great customer service, great price, great variety. I highly recommend them. Make sure you're subscribed and stay tuned for that bridal brooch bouquet tutorial that I'm sure you're going to love. Thanks for watching. Take care.